So here we are back with another mouse case for the Pixel 9 Pro XL, so let's check it out. What's up guys, welcome back to Michael's Tech Talk. So if you did catch my previous video, which was the thin cases from mouse, then this is one that I always pick up and try. This is the limitless case and this is the armored fiber. So let's check this out. Live life without limits. Made for Google. And there we go. And there it is. So, yeah, all the same characteristics of the Limitless case. Yeah, it's as expected. Armored fiber, camera guard, molded buttons. These are plastic. Yeah, pretty straightforward. So, first off, let's just weigh this case. 50, 51 grams. So, that's to be expected. This is a more rugged case. This has the shock absorption material on the inside to help protect the phone. This is the type of case where you see the guys in the adverts throwing them up in the air and blah blah blah. Let's just pop the pixel into the case and yeah there it is. Lovely. Very very nice. I'm a sucker for armored fiber. I really am. So we've got our mouse branding down here which is quite subtle. We've got our plastic buttons here which are clicky, tactile, no issues there. That's great. There's our cutouts on the top end for the microphone. On the bottom, we've got our speaker cutout, USB-C, and our microphone cutout there. So everything's easily accessible there. The fitment, I expect this to be top. The fitment usually is. If I just take the corners and give the phone a twist, yeah, the phone is securely gripped in there. It is not moving. It's not going to come loose at all. That is what you want to see. If we check out the screen lip then, so you can see it's raised up at the corners here. It comes a little bit flatter down by the sides, but you still get a little bit of a lip there, but it's raised extra at the corners. So if you set that down flat, you're going to get that lift up protection that your display isn't going to touch the surface. That's what you want to see. And of course then if you look on the back, because this case is a little bit thicker, there's not really much of a bump there. You just get a minimal raise for where the camera bar is and it comes up over the glass of that as well so if you set that down flat you will have that uh, lift up protection and because it is pretty much flat on the back you'll get no rock as well on your surface that's pretty cool feel of it is nice down the sides we've got this grippy texture which does help hold the phone uh, really well in your hand it's not going to slip and fall out your hand which is really what you want uh, it is smooth on the back and the armored fiber will get lots of fingerprints it's the nature of the beast, unfortunately, but it is what it is. The rest of it is like a hard plastic and it, it is pretty hard wearing. And, you know, it probably will get scuffed up if you drop it, but that's what a case is supposed to do. It is MagSafe compatible, so we can do a MagSafe test. Now, this is the case I have been looking forward to testing because on the limitless cases uh, for the past couple of years, I have said time and time again, the magnets on them are really, really poor. They're just not strong enough and the phone needs to have stronger magnets. I'm hoping that they changed it. Now the magnets in the thin cases were a lot better than what the previous mouse cases have been for me. And I was really impressed with them. So I'm really looking forward to checking this out. So yeah, let's do it. So this is a heavy phone and a heavy case. Mm-hmm. Oh, I should have put the dummy phone in here for this. <laughs> oh, man. Well, I will say the the magnets are definitely stronger than what they have been before. But, uh, yeah, it did, uh, it did fall quite a rattle there. So, yeah. There is a bit of improvement there, but... I think for the weight, for the thickness of this case and for the weight of the phone, they need to be a little bit stronger. <sighs> that made, that scared me. That scared me. Oh man. To summarize, the magnets in the limitless cases before have been really, really poor, but this one is an improvement. I would like to see it a little bit better mouse. So yeah, if you end up watching this video, yeah, that's my feedback. Uh, good case, uh, it needs to be a little bit stronger MagSafe for my liking, can't complain. If you want a bit of a rugged case with a good bit of protection that still looks good, 
yeah, the Limitless is uh, the way to go. There is a lot of different versions that come in this. There's the likes of the Lever, there's the Bamboo, there's uh, there's a couple of different patterns as well. So I, I always go for the Armored myself, personally, because that's my bag. But uh, yeah, if you are interested in picking uh, any of these Limitless cases up, I will leave you a link in the description down below. I feel like links help support the channel, but they don't cost you guys any more money. So if you do pick up using my links, thanks for your support. Much appreciated. That about wraps up this video, guys. I hope you liked it. If you did, smash that like button for me. And don't forget to click that subscribe and ring that little bell to be notified of new videos just like this one. Keep it locked to the channel. I have a lot more Pixel 9 Pro XL content coming for you, so stay tuned. And, of course, if you want some more down-to-earth tech review and accessory videos, you know where to come. And until the next one, I'll catch you later. This is your phone in a mouse case! Yeah, it's annoying.